Main Mobility is an autonomous transportation company. We build our own autonomous driving technology and we work with cities to deploy it in places to solve their hardest transportation problems. Main Mobility's goal is to elevate the rider experience. Right next to me is one of our new generation Toyota Siennas, which includes Ava's sensors. And you can see there are two Ava's on the roof so that we can see as far as possible down road. We use a combination of LiDAR, radar, and camera, all designed around the specific ODD that we operate in. Ava's technology is really exciting. It basically combines some of the best capabilities of LiDAR with the best capabilities of radar. Multi-policy decision-making is our secret sauce for building an AV. Instead of one large software stack that always has to make the right call in every situation, we have about 16 different autonomous driving stacks on our vehicle. And as the vehicle's driving around, it's running a tournament to decide which of those stacks is the best suited for the specific situation we're in at that exact moment. The big advantage of this is that it means that our system can figure out how to solve problems that it's never seen before. One of the challenges that we have with conventional LiDARs is their limited range and their susceptibility to interference from the sun. As we want to expand the places that we can operate, increase our speeds, we're looking for higher performance LiDARs that can deliver better data at longer ranges. That's one of the reasons we're excited to be working with Ava. Ava has a really interesting approach to building their LiDARs. They're using an FMCW technology, which has a number of really key advantages in terms of noise rejection, but also providing range rate data at every pixel. And that helps us compute better velocity estimates for all the other objects in the world. Today, main mobility's vehicles don't go on freeways. And the reason for that actually isn't because freeways are hard. Freeways are actually quite predictable and manageable environments. But you need to be able to see very long ranges. Today's amplitude modulated LiDARs have a lot of trouble seeing that far down road. Working with AVA, we hope to expand the speeds at which we can operate, which in turn means that we will have access to a larger addressable market, which in turn will drive the growth of our company. May Mobility today is live in four cities. In the next few years, you're gonna see May Mobility everywhere. The problems that we're solving for public transit are problems faced by virtually every transit agency across the United States. We're looking forward to working with Ava really closely over the next couple of years to tune our perception algorithms and our vehicles to use their sensors. And then that will lead to volume production in 2025, and you'll see an entirely new generation of vehicles from May.